Royals and the Red Sox Saturday night. Ordano Ventura facing Matt Barnes, but Barnes finds trouble top one in the form of Kendrys Morales. And there's a smack to left field, but Ramirez tries to climb the wall and banks high off the wall. Kane scores. Here comes Hosmer to the plate. Ramirez throw is not in time, and the Royals take the 2-0 lead on another two-out hit by that man. And the Red Sox have two on with two out. Breaking ball got him swinging. So for the second time, Ventura strikes out Bradley to end the inning. He's all deep in the mind of the Red Sox hitter. They're all going, wow, you know what? We just got to go up there and look for the fastball and hope he leaves one out over the plate. Look at that. This is no problem. Good breaking ball. And Mookie Betts swings and misses. Ventura. Just cruising here in the fifth, throwing strikes. And a half swing, he went around, and that is a strikeout. So Ventura strikes out the side, and he has four consecutive strikeouts. So at the end of five, it remains the Royals two and Boston nothing. Salvi 286 with a runner in scoring position. They need some more runs for Ventura. And he does hit it well to right field. Get up! And that ball is gone! Three run home run by Salvador Perez. Ventura can use some more runs. And that is a career high for Salvador Perez with his 18th home run. The Red Sox infield now set up for a triple play. And a line drive into center field for a hit. Round third and headed for home is Moustakis, and the Royals have added to their lead. It is now six to two. Now all of a sudden it's become a dicey situation. The bases are loaded for Travis Shaw. And he goes out to the first pitch and pops it up. Mike Moustakis, game over. Royals earn the 6-3 win as Boston sees their season high tying winning streak snapped at four. Jordano Ventura stretches his unbeaten streak to six starts following six innings of one run ball with six Ks. Every Royal starter had a hit in this one, except for leadoff hitter Alcides Escobar. He went 0 for 5.